yeah, now we're going to head to Zora River. And it's near dusk, by the looks of it. But it's dusk. You can't actually use your horse when you're a child on this game, which is a bit of a bummer. Alright, so Zora's River, not a lot's changed here, I don't think. Although it's night time, there might be a couple skeletons we can get. I already got that one, didn't we? Is it worth us buying another magic bean? I don't think we even need any more, to be honest. Right, so up here, if you remember last time we passed, there were a bunch of frogs. And now that we've got, like, every single, like, normal song, like, non-warp song, we can actually do something here. Oh, oh fuck. Shit. But if we get on this log, go down here, some frogs are looking at you from underwater. Pull out ocarina. I believe the first thing you're going to want to play is the Song of Storms that we got. And they'll jump in time with the notes. Wow, that melody is so cool, Ribbit! Singing in the rain, oh what a feeling, Ribbit! Please take this as a token of our froggish gratitude, Ribbit. Alright, see you, Ribbit! And there we go! You've completed another heart container. Your maximum energy has increased. Nice. But yeah, one thing you're going to want to do here is there's like a bug catching kind of mini game thing. But I believe you need all of these grey songs. So if we just start playing each individual song. I think this is how it works. It's been quite long since I've done it. And they should like start growing. Yeah, so he started growing. Take rupees as a souvenir. I, sorry, I skipped that. Fuck, oh, that's a lot of rupees. Yeah, just play every song you know at this point, apart from the warp ones. There's another one growing up. Take rupees. Oh shit, I skipped it again. Fuck, you get loads of rupees from doing this. Absolutely loads. Ah, oh, do the right thing. Is that the yellow one going to grow? Oh no. I'd skipped it again! How do I skip it three times? Fuck. What songs haven't we played? Song of Time. What's the other one now? Unless we got to do the Song of Storms again, unless there's one I forgot. Like an idiot. Sorry, a song, we haven't played that, have we? I scooped it! Young lad, you played the ocarina well. Hmm, that melody is so fine, Ribbit. We all should practice it, Ribbit. Take rupees as a souvenir. If you come up with another nice melody, please drop by and play it, Ribbit, Ribbit. So what melody haven't we not played? Those long by song, song, song. Unless they're on about the song. Look at us, we're all huge frogs. We are we are the world famous, fabulous, five froggish tenter. What the fuck? Make us jump so we can eat the bugs flying above our head. Oh no, this is what I remember. Oh. So you just need to pay attention to what ones you... So that's A. No. Great.
Oh my god, we've done it! Young boy, you did great! Perfect! We are stuffed, Ribbit. Would you take this token of our gratitude? I will, after all that fucking time doing it. Collect four heart pieces in total, so thank you. You, you guys, I'll never have to see you again. Although there are frogs in the sequel. And they're quite annoying as well. But yeah, we're going to go to Lost Woods, because there's someone we need to meet there to give a mask. Throw that rock. Yeah. So, we're going to head to that shortcut. I might leave this in because we haven't been here in quite a while. And I don't think we really need to come back here after this point. There's... Oh, we will actually because... Well, I won't say, but we do at some point. Right, so let's dive down here. There we go. Right. There should also be, um... Oh, shit, what was I going to say? Oh, I was going to say so important. You know what? Fuck it. Right, so over here. Let's get our skull mask. And who's this? This is the skull kid. So if we put on the skull mask... Hey, hey! Under that mask, aren't you that Kikiri kid? Quite an unusual mask you have there, hee hee. I like it. It may make me look a little bit tougher. Hey, why don't you give it to me? Okay. Yowza, I'm gonna wear this all the time. He just gave you 10 rupees for that 20 rupee mask. You lost money on that deal, you bastard. He'll get his comeuppance, I'm, I feel. And he just fades into nothing. See, I'm going to play the Prelude of Light just to get out of here. And then I'll meet you back in Castle Market. Right, so here we are. We can actually go and pay Matey for the mask. And unfortunately, the mask we just unlocked, we got to go back to Kakariko again. Again. So, we paid him for that mask because Matey was really horrible and didn't give us enough money. But now we got the spooky mask, which looks kind of like a redead. You can scare many people with this mask. Shall we try putting it on? Scare a couple people? That should make us feel a bit better. God, it is a bit freaky. Let's talk to this woman. Yeah? What's your problem? Nothing. I ain't got a problem. What's your problem? Hmm, well, don't you have any other masks? What's wrong with this one? Yeah, help me. What? Does she mean like, ah, help me? I don't know. But yeah, let's make our way back to Kakariko for like the hundredth time. So yeah, back here, you remember there was that little kid playing in the graveyard? Well, that's the guy that we're going to sell this mask to. So yeah, hopefully this will be the last trip here for quite a while. We've gone back here like three times during like one recording session. Obviously it'll be different episodes, but you're probably fed up with this place. Hey, mate. Little kids can't go on. Oh, you told me all this. Yeah, it's Dampy the Gravekeeper. Oh, it's just a mask. I get a different kind of fright from that mask than I get from Dampe. Will you give that mask to me? Yeah, go for it. With this mask, I'll be just like Dampe. Here's my money. You sold the 30 rupee mask to a kid for the full price, and he didn't mind paying at all. Let's go back to the mask shop to pay the 30 rupees for the mask. You can get the new mask model too. Nice. So yeah, again, we're going to fucking go back to Market Town. This is getting quite quite ridiculous now. But yeah, I'll meet you back there. Right, so this is um the next mask we get is that the actual last mask that we could trade. And then he like unlocks a bunch of different masks we can just like use for the hell of it. So yeah, payment received. Bunny Hood. One of my favourite um, masks in the like sequel to this game. So good. The hood's long ears are so cute! They are indeed. This one doesn't function at all like the one in Majora's Mask, but it looks cool anyway. Look at that. Look at my bunny ears! Bitch, yeah, what's your problem? Why does everyone say that? I just want to be a bunny. Oh, please go bother someone else. Nobody appreciates my bunny goodness. 
But yeah, with the bunny hood, this lovely thing, there's going to be a man running around the field like a sprinter. And if we can find him, he's going to want to buy the mask off us. Well, if you can call it a mask, it's hardly a mask, is it? But I believe his route is around Lon Lon Ranch. So just, if you eventually, if you just keep running around, you should eventually run into him. It's a bit of a weird thing. Oh, and also, I don't think you can do this until you've had, if until you've got all three spiritual stones. Obviously, I've done that ages ago now, but I just thought I'd mention it in case you're doing it before, um, before you're an adult. So, this might take a while to actually find Matey. I don't even know if he's out at night, is he? Hopefully. I don't actually know what direction he runs in. We should eventually find them. If it takes too long, I can just clip it out. There's a pea hat over there. I don't think we've shown that off yet, is that? Ah! There he is. See him? Oh, he's sitting down. Do you want to sit? Why, hello there, good chap. I bet with those long ears you can hear this, the voices. What voices? Oh, these are genuine rabbit ears from the animal of legend. I don't care how expensive it is. Please sell it to me. Yes, my long time dream returning to the wildlife. Finally, the actor's stage and prop have been reunited. It's a 50 rupee mask, but he paid you a crazy amount of money for it. More money than you can count. Go back to the mask shop and pay back just 50 rupees. What is he doing? Why didn't you just go to Castletown? Look, he's actually wearing it over his eyes. That isn't how you're meant to wear it. That's fucking creepy, actually. Look at that. Fucking hell, that is creepy. But yeah, and while we're on this side of Hyrule, Ca um, Castle? Hyrule Field, we can actually check out a place we haven't been yet, which is down here. It's not necessary, but there's, there's um, a couple of collectibles we can get as a child, I believe. So you might as well do it now. Die, please. Anything up there? Money. Oh, we got full money. A full 500. Right. In this place it's new. Well, it is new. And I believe there is... I don't know if it's any good of a secret, but there is a secret over here. My controller's vibrating like it should. Nice, I forgot what this actually is. Oh, should we get that bomb? Why not? It's probably nothing really important. Ah, we could actually use Din's fire for something. Oh shit! That's something I forgot to do. Oh no, it's all good. It's all good. So I have to go back there anyway, but there's something I've missed. Quite stupidly, actually. Come here. I can't believe I missed that. It's something I always make sure to get as well. Oh, bugs! I was talking about bugs. Let's catch some bugs in our bottle. There we go. You caught a bug in a bottle, you can release it by these bugs for living in small holes in the ground. So, yeah, like I said, you can use the little soil patches. Oh, there is a skeleton. I thought it was going mental. Right. Get him. I said get him. I wish you could target these guys. You can target their token. You destroyed a gold skeleton. Nice. Right, so we can actually head out this way. It's not anything like massive at the moment, it's just just to show it off more than anything. And this is Gerudo Valley or Gerudo Valley, however you want to say it. And this isn't until quite a bit later, but we're not actually going in there. As you saw, there were quite a few people standing guard. Have we got another bottle? Nah, no, fuck it. 
We got milk, bugs, and a fairy. There's fish down there, but yeah, look at all these fish. Whoa, I didn't want to go up closer, look. I wanted to get up that ramp. But fish nonetheless, look at that. Yeah, can't really do a lot here at the moment. If we cross that bridge, we're going to get flamed. But down here, there's a massive abyss. And I believe that over there is something we want to get, that box. And also, back towards here, there's a waterfall. And if we get this chicken, another chicken, it's chicken time again. I forget where you have to jump. Probably the bridge. Unless he go... Yeah, in fact, I'm not going to try the bridge. Go up here. We're going to want to try and fly to the waterfall. This is risky business. Are we even going to make it? I hope we do. But I believe you can only do this as you're a kid. You might actually be able to do it as an adult, thinking about it. can't actually remember. Yeah, you can see a little alcove. That's what we're aiming for. Let's get in there. Nice. And look, a piece of heart. Another piece of heart. And quite a few of them. But I believe the other thing we wanted to do, we can't actually do, because we're going to get washed away down here. And we're going to want to just get back up to the top of um, Gerudo Valley. So, once I land, thank you. Oh shit, there's people there. What will they do if they see me? Oh, nothing, apparently. Why did you come all the way down here? What, you were just about to ask me the same thing? Well, now that you're down here, you may as well make the best of things. Yeah, oh. Should I plant a thing here? In fact, we got bugs. Maybe the bugs want to go in here. Maybe they don't. Oh, there we go. And there you go. I don't think all of them do it, but the majority of them do. It's an easy sculpture. Sculpture? Skulltula, or whatever the fuck I've been calling them all this time. Smash this, nothing in there, great. But yeah, if we go down here, we're just going to wash back up in Lake Hylia. And I want to get someone else that's here. And I don't think we need this um, patch of grass, because we can get it as a kid. But um, yeah, I'm going to get washed away, and I'll meet you back at the top of Druda Valley. Right, so back here, I hope I'm right with this. Like I said, you can get it as a um, child. I believe you can, because this chicken is back. A whole lot of love for this chicken. Pick him up. And remember that box I told you about? Not the one we were with by that person. This one right over there. Can we get lucky? Can we get lucky? Can we get lucky? Can we get lucky? Yes, it looks like we have got lucky. Thank you. Bash! Get! Thank you. I think we got nearly all of the ones we can get as a kid. Which is very nice. But yeah, I'm going to go back and trade in that mask for that money. Right, so let's, let's see what we got for our final mask. Like I said, I think that was the last one. Oh great, you sold it! Please pay me back 50 rupees for the bunny hood now. Oh yeah, very well done! All the masks are sold out! I knew I could trust you. As a reward, I will lend you this special mask. This is the Mask of Truth. It is a mysterious mask passed down by the Sheikah. With this mask, you can see into other people's minds. It's useful, but scary. Why is it scary? You may find out as you grow older and discover the true meaning of life. Ho ho ho! So there we go, you borrowed the Mask of Truth, where it was C to show it off, show, to, show it to many people. From now on, you can borrow any mask you want, just have faith. So yeah, we can... In fact, I'll just scroll through and show you what ones there are. Which mask can I lend to you? Right, so you got a Gerardo mask. It makes a great lady's disguise. I don't know if you can actually disguise yourself with that. I'm not sure. And you got the Zora mask. 
You'll look cool while you're swimming and if you're wearing this mask, the Goron mask. And then all the masks that we sold. And the Mask of Truth, which we have. And I'll quickly show that. And there we go, that's the last... Well, that's the, the end result of the kid's side quest kind of thing. But yeah, if we wear this... Yeah, well, oh, fuck you. But no, the, bi the biggest thing you can do with them is remember the um, Sheikah Stones, these things that tell you the time when you hit them. Tell us the time. 12 o'clock, thank you. So yeah, if we put a mask on and talk to it... Responding to your mask, this strange stone statue talks to you. I overheard this. They say that it is against the rules to use glasses at the treasure chest shop in Hyrule Castle Town Market. Glasses? We don't have any glasses. Responding to your mask, this strange stone blah blah blah. I overheard this. They say that Malon of Lon Lon Ranch hopes a knight in shining armor will come and sweep her off her feet someday. God, but yeah, you got all these little, little bonus things, which is quite nice to have. It's attention to detail. But yeah, um, what have we done? Done quite a bit. Fuck, we've already got a new... Well, nearly got a new one again. So I think next time... Um, yeah, seeing as we're still a kid, we'll go back to Kakariko. And um, we'll talk to the guy in the windmill, I think. Because he seemed a bit angry at a kid that fucked up his windmill. We're going to see what happened. But yeah, thank you for watching. And until next time...